Hey, what's up, guys? Your average war game is back with another video of World of Warships. And today I'm going to be featuring tier 10 Tech 3 battleship, and that is American Montana. Now, here uh, I want to showcase you that uh, if you are looking to uh, grind a battleship, and especially I'm talking about the new players, I think this is one of the battleships that you should definitely play. Uh, dispersion, as you can see, is pretty, pretty consistent. I mean, you have 12 of the guns. Even though I aim terribly, I, I thought the Vichita might show broadside. But these are 406 millimeter guns, which having decent alpha damage of 13,500. And I mean, it does have a decent health pool of 96,000. So rest assured that you will have a decent survivability for this particular battleship. But here, I think the Burgon is starting to farm me with HE, which is actually a dangerous thing. But still, regardless, I can try and showcase you some of the salvos that you can actually get, which are pretty rewarding, to be honest. So if you know what you're doing, you can absolutely do something like that. I shot the Hindenburg. I'm not sure if I can get a decent salvo or not. The Hindenburg is turning in, which is nice. I think he might get some damage for sure, I believe. I got three over pens. <laughs> So it's unfortunate, but sometimes it does happen. Uh, I mean, it's a battleship, so it can definitely happen sometime for like something like that. So don't worry about it. But most of the time, Montana for the new players is really, really good. And if you know what you're doing, you will definitely going to enjoy a whole lot. Here, the Burgon is, I don't know if he's reversing. I can go and shoot this uh, Burgon with this AP, I, even though, even though you should probably switch to HE if you get the, you know, some fires on him because you cannot overmatch Burgon with these guns. These are only 406 mm guns, just like I said. But still, hitting on the superstructure does mean that you will still going to get some decent damage. And you can also switch your, you know, guns if you have expert loader or gun feeder in the captain skills, which I exactly did. Since the Iowas are broadsiding and they have very vulnerable broadside, to be honest. And this Iowa is broadsiding at the moment. Let's see if I can get a good hit on this Iowa. And He's broadsiding a bit more, which is nice, and I aimed around the turrets. I don't know if, the, if I'm going to get some citadel hits, but let's see. I got some good damage, 13,333, which is good, but still not that much, to be honest. So I can just slightly push in and see if I can do something about maybe this Napoli he might turn out. No, he's not turning out. And there's a Hindenburg that I can also go and drop. Is he gonna... he's turning in. I think he's turning in because of the Nakimov, I see. And there's a Burgon that is also broadsiding, which is nice. So I can shoot the Burgon with this massive broadside of his. I shoot the Burgon. Dispersion looks pretty good. And if I manage to get a decent salvo, I think he will eat 20k damage for sure. Yeah, oh my goodness, 16k, which is nice. Especially it's a Burgon. I mean, it's, it's having a bit of a smaller profile, I would say. It's a bit fast, so shooting and getting that much salvo is pretty good so it was nice to see that montana still does pretty nice and wow this iowa shot with that insane dispersion <laughs> pretty hilarious to be honest this iowa broadside shoot the iowa and trying to kite back again because i fear that i might get slightly overextended uh, i don't know if this iowa will eat some damage or not but let's see Oh, just aim too bad, I would say. Just a bit too much, like uh, having a bit too much upper lead. So, and I even, yeah, I was actually broadsiding. No, I actually get my broadside to be honest. Vegeta, can I shoot him? He's turning out. He's turning in actually. Oh, never mind. So I will turn out here and we'll try to get some crossfire. Hopefully, there is a Hindenburg that shot AP. I think I got a Citadel. Nice. So Vishta basically is dead and now I can maybe shoot this, these Iowas and San Vincent is doing a good job in get, getting a nasty broadside of these uh, guys and let's see if I can do some damage with this Iowa. Well, Napoli is dead, devastated by the Burgon. Unfortunately, they are not doing the right thing and I can shoot this Iowa hopefully to get a decent salvo or Burgon will shot at me. So gotta be careful. Yeah, Burgon just slightly misaimed it which is nice. I got a say oh I got a really nasty salvo on the Iowa which is nice we're going shooting with the, the reload booster I mean uh, French uh, battleship does have a reload booster so I can see what he's doing and there is a Bryson that shot at me so gotta be careful don't want to show broadside like this 
a shot at the, uh, this Bryson. Hopefully to do some good damage. He's slowing down, apparently. He's got only two penetrations, which is unfortunate. And see if I can just turn out and do some more damage. Well, there's an Apple he's pushing. Okay, I will just run away. And might do some damage to this uh, Bryson or maybe the Napoli. Yeah, he smoked up, apparently. Yeah, he smoked up. So I can shoot this guy and get a juicy salvo on Bryson if Bryson is not moving that much. I slightly mistamed it to be honest, but still. Oh, I got his guns, two of them guns, <laughs> which is hilarious. I will just keep running away. I have their pretty decent broadsides at the moment. And let's see if I can actually do a bit more damage on Pryson. Pryson is definitely a bit more vulnerable. The enemy team is really running away from our team at uh, Seaside, which is nice. And I can just get another decent salvo on this Pryson, hopefully to deal a bit more damage. I don't know if I aimed it a bit correctly, but let's see. Yeah, got a really juicy 24k salvo, great. So I'm doing just fine right now. It's pretty good to see that I'm doing fine. <laughs> like uh, I'm getting rewarded by good hits, which is nice. So let's see if I can get another salvo on this, maybe a Republic or maybe the Napoli. No, Napoli is running away. And Bryson is turning out again. I shot at him again. Dispersion looks pretty okay, but he's he might just turn out again, hopefully. Nah. Yeah, we'll get some good damage. I think I aim absolutely great. Yeah, see this? 12k damage, which is good. Is anyone showing broadside? And I think it's the Republic. Republic is broadsiding. Vista is super low, which is good. I will do something about this uh, Republic here real quick. And let's see if I can get a good salvo on this guy. Shut the guns. Republic is moving again like a straight liner. Now nice. slightly moving faster. Aim just a bit bad, I would say. Still get good damage. I mean, it's okay damage. <laughs> but still, regardless, I see if I can push back and do something about these BBs. And try to tank a bit more damage because, well, I know that uh, I'm not tanking a whole lot right now. And seems to be Ivo getting... I was showing broadside. Is he gonna move? Oh, he's moving like this. He's moving a bit faster. I believe he's gonna move faster. So I shot at him. Giving the enough lead, I believe. And if I aimed it correctly, hopefully I will get a decent salvo on this Iowa. Yep, five penetrations, pretty good. There's a Napoli, so I will push back and see if I can do something about this Iowa again. He's turning in though, and there's another Iowa. So let's see if I can get it. Now he's turning in. Oh, he's basically turning in, so yeah. I'm gonna switch to HE just to get a permanent fire. Hopefully I will get it. He damage controlled the fire, so I know that if I get a decent salvo on him, even though he like he's angled, I will get a decent damage. I shot at him. I don't know, is he looking to turn out? He's not. A bit bad aim, I would say. It's not really good aim, but hopefully I will get some damage to, to, to penetration hits. I will wait here. And he's gonna show broadside for sure. Let's do it. Okay, eight seconds. Okay, broadsiding Iowa, please. And let's do it. Oh no! The dispersion was pretty good, but he got disengaged, and then the island actually, yeah, caused this issue, which is unfortunate. But it's gonna be just fine. I will try to shoot him back. I have their broadsides at the moment, so I shouldn't be having any issues. So let's see if I can just turn out a bit and try to get another salvo on this Iowa. He's turning out actually pretty hard. Maybe this other Iowa. Shot this guy, which is nice. I got the cap, which is great as well. Let's see if I can get some damage on this Iowa and seems to be looking good. Yeah, some damage, which is good. And there's a maximum man running away. Maybe I shoot him and try to kill him because obviously. Uh, but if I kill him, the game is actually pretty much over. So I will go and drop maybe the salvo on either the Iowa and Republic. Trying to get the juicy salvo. Is it possible? Okay, I will shoot the Republic. Shooting the Republic here. Maybe getting some damage on him if possible. 
There are only four battleships. Oh, he's slowing down or something. I think I just messed up a bit. I didn't expect that. Gonna speed juke that. Speed juking that and hopefully that should be enough. To basically, yeah, like letting them miss completely, which is good. And now I will shoot this eye over hopefully again. He's turning in. I will shoot this Iowa. The Brugon is pretty low, to be honest. And if I can kill the Brugon, that would be pretty nice. I get one penetration. I don't know. Hopefully, I will push back and do some damage. Yeah, Iowa is dead. Nice. I have my guns loading up, which is important. And Republic is broadsiding. Yeah, Republic is broadsiding. So is the Iowa. I was broadsiding, which is great. So I shoot the Iowa. Hopefully, I will get some damage. Yeah, I didn't get a Citadel, which is weird. I will damage on this. Uh, okay, CV is coming. I will try to do something about this guy as well. He might drop me, but he he's not looking to do that. Shimakaza got him. Nice. I just uh, try to basically shoot this Republic with all the guns loaded. Hopefully can do some damage and see if I can do that I mean I'm sure the maximum will drop me now and there's nothing that I can do like really that there's nothing that I can do and I shoot the Republic and I got some damage it's not enough got the Confederate which is also nice we'll pop the heal because I'm going to eat all torpedoes yeah, got some hard damage because of the torpedoes and the Republic. I was slightly broadside. Shooting the Republic's uh, superstructure. Hopefully, we'll be able to manage to kill this guy. I got this guy, which is nice. And uh, yeah. Oh, he got another Citadel, unfortunately, as you can see. But well, the game is actually over, so it's a GG. So, Montana is definitely a ship that I really love to play. It is really, really good even in 2024 and i really enjoy this ship uh, a lot and as you can see 207k damage one kill two citadel hits and uh, team score wise i think second in the team which is nice our Wujing played really well so props to this guy and i will compliment him detail report wise i did damage to a lot of ships out there i mean i got a citadel on Wichita. i think i also get the citadel on this iowa as well so pretty good damage across the board and uh, yeah so if you like the gameplay definitely subscribe and i will catch you into the next one peace out